Hi, Assalamualaikum. Selamat Hari Raya to all my pupils. So, for today's lesson, we are going to focus on module 4 celebrations, ordinal numbers. Alright, there are two learning objectives for today's lesson. First, you should be able to see the ordinal numbers first to 31st with the correct pronunciation. And uh, you should be able to write the ordinal numbers first to 31st with correct spelling. Alright, what is ordinal numbers? Okay. Usually, in ordinal numbers, you can see number and letters. So, how do you say the numbers? Okay, now repeat after me. First. Second. Third. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, twentieth. 21st, 22nd, 30th, 31st. Okay, so what is ordinal numbers? Ordinal numbers are numbers that define position of something. Okay, position of something. For example, Ali won first place. Ali menang tempat pertama. So, first refer to the position. And, uh, for example, in dates. Okay, we have 1, 2. Okay, this is 1st February. Okay, so 1st February means... Hari pertama dalam bulan Februari. Alright, the first day in February. Alright, so uh, let's take a look at the spelling. Okay, for one, first, it must follow with ST. Two, second, and D. Three, third, RD. Okay, the same goes with 21st. 22nd, 23rd. Okay, it follows the rule of 1st, 2nd, 3rd. Alright, uh, as you can see here, 31st, 32nd, 33rd. Alright, but for 11th, we do not, we did not say 11th. Okay, this is wrong. The correct answer will be 11th. Alright, uh, so for 10th, okay, we put TH, 10th. Okay, 20th, 30th, 40th, 50th. Alright, so that's how you say it. 20th, 30th, 40th, 50th. Alright, so for today's lesson, we have two tasks. Task number one, record a voice note saying the dates below. Okay, for example, number one, okay, you, you should say 1st March, right? Next, task two, uh, you need to write the numbers below with the correct spelling in your W1 book. You can also refer to your CEFR textbook. Alright, so for example, if I give you the number 11th, you need to write down the words 11th. Alright, here comes the fun part. Okay, for today's project, I want you to choose one. Okay, which one do you like? Would you like to decorate a birthday cake or make a party hat? Right? Here are two templates. 
So, if you would like to decorate your birthday cake, you can draw the birthday cake and you can fill them with the colors that you like. Alright? Or, let's say uh, you want to do the party hat, you can take a piece of paper and uh, draw the template and also cut it to make a party hat. You can decorate them with your favorite colors or your favorite patterns. Up to your creativity, how would you like to make your party hat? Okay, and uh, remember to take a picture of your project and send it to the classroom WhatsApp group. Alright, so that's all for today's lesson. Thank you. Stay safe and healthy. Stay at home. Bye.